Oh, that one in the middle of the open plain there, that looks like a little boy. Sort of a sub adult male. It looks like they are hoping that the other one chases the water out of the lake and straight into them. They've pretty much got that warthog surrounded, so it's going to get interesting. They're definitely walking with purpose. They're not just having a casual stroll. You can see that one that we can still see in the open there. It's peering into that thicket. She's hoping that that uh, warthog comes bursting out of there. They also have the wind in their favour. The wind's blowing from the warthog towards them. Does the warthog know they're there now? Uh, no. No, if the warthog knew that they were there, they probably wouldn't stand much of a chance of catching it. Where's the water, Jeff? See that, that main line, that young one. The one walking on the right? Yeah. Yeah? Right in front of you. Okay, so keep an eye on that line that's walking to the right there. Apparently that warthog's right in front of him somewhere. Did he just lie down? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and the warthog's just up and to the left of him. So that's why he's laid down. It's because the warthog's looking towards him. And the warthog doesn't know they're there? No. The warthog's so close. Yeah, unfortunately warthogs, well unfortunately for the warthogs, they their senses aren't the greatest. They've got a very good sense of smell and that's about it. But he's just having a casual munch, enjoying breakfast. He's oblivious. Little does he know that there's a whole bunch of lions busy watching him. Oh, this is sad. All four lions are now in the train spot. Um so the warthog, you see the line that you can see most of its body sticking out of? Uh, just to the right of that, there's uh, the warthog. So the warthog's basically between the two lines. I see that, yeah. Oh, the one's getting up, ready for action. See him moving on the on the right there, stalking in. Closer and closer that one line. Yeah. The warthog's just behind the bush at the moment, so you can't quite see it. But I'm sure we're going to see it soon when it starts running away from that line. Just to the left of where that line disappeared, it's very, very difficult to see. It's not out in the open. Yeah. So the other one's right in front of the warthog, and the other one's right in front of it. So there are two warthogs there. Dogs come out into the open a little bit more now, which is amazing because I think there's a line in the bush where that war dog is. Yeah. Uh, in total, I think there's probably about five lines down there. Um, I've only, I can't see any of the lines at the moment. Just see the one war dog. Another war dog's walking straight towards another line there. Now. The other line. Oh, those warthogs are walking 
jump straight into a death trap. Very patient. They're waiting for just the perfect opportunity. They're doing a very good job of keeping calm these lines because the warthogs are almost right on top of them. If they were younger and more inexperienced, they would have probably run out after the warthogs too early and uh, chased them away. There you go, there's a warthog jogging, there goes the line. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, they got him, they've got it. Yeah, those lines must be very hungry. But at the end of the day, that warthog's in so much shock, it has no idea what's going on. It's not like it's uh, it's really suffering all that much. I think it's uh, it's so adrenaline filled and in shock, it's, it's dazed and confused. But I don't think it's going to last too long because I think the lines have really started munching quite a quite a bit of it. How can it last at all? <laughs> Oh yeah, they weren't messing around, so the one lioness is still busy trying to kill it by holding it down on its throat and do the, doing the proper job, the others are like great, you're just holding it so we can eat it. Yeah, well I suppose it's the circle of life, everyone has to eat it. <laughs> Uh, she will as soon as she's uh, she's decided that uh, it's dead. Yeah, yeah. Now that warthog's definitely dead. <laughs> doesn't really have anything left to live with. <laughs> oh, that lioness could definitely let go of the throat now. And yeah, yeah, she's going to miss out on a lot of food. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. These lads aren't messing around this morning. These lines aren't messing around this morning, yeah.
To, to, to silly, see a kill happen doesn't happen very often, eh? But like I said, it's, uh, it's something that a lot of people want to see until they actually see it. Yeah, I agree with that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like killing you. Yeah. At least I finished this one off very quickly. I, don't, uh, <laughs> I haven't had anyone. It's, it's always time for a first. Uh, <laughs> I feel bad for this. I know this is how I have to get to work, but I just feel bad. They eat everything? Uh, they'll, yeah, they'll eat most of it, uh, they tend not to eat the stomach, um, and uh, they'll normally leave the head, but uh, like the smaller bones and that they'll just bite through. And, uh, huh? <laughs> There's actually a species of weevil that eats the brain, so uh, once the skull's left there, there's a weevil that'll eat. Yeah. Uh, we do have our hyenas. Uh, we have uh, brown hyenas, so they'll come and finish off whatever they have. Uh, also jackals, so they'll come and uh, finish off if there's anything left. The way those four are eating, I don't know if there's going to be much left. Well, they go to sleep after finishing. Yeah, they'll, 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 they'll more than likely have a good snooze after that. No, it's a case of whoever can eat the most, the quickest wins. And are they all the same? There's some that are older. Uh, they're all the same age, so they're oh. all siblings. Um, they're probably about a year and a half old there, about. And then one male? Uh, two boys and two girls. Oh. So you can see this one on the left here, you can see this little mane that goes over his uh -huh. ridge, the ridge of his head. Uh, it's just his mane starting to grow, and then the one on the right there is the little girl. It's amazing, I'm going to do video now because I'm going to do a lot of videos on YouTube and uh, people love gore, eh? Yeah. Like I have like these really cute videos and that but as soon as I put up a video of something like getting eaten alive or like something really gory They're really easy to catch. As you can see, those warthogs, they're just, oh, what a beautiful Sunday morning. We're all just going for a little walk down to the bushes here. The lions manage to like surround them. And they, they, like I said, their senses aren't really the greatest. They've got a very good sense of smell, but uh, it's not, a, not quite the, the sense that you want to mainly rely on our turn.
Not our chair, no. <laughs>